today. Well, I have a theory. I think feminism is becoming unpopular. So this is Friday. I have to talk about feminism. You know, I don't know if you noticed this. Uh, when you talk to a hardcore feminist, they don't really want to talk about men's issues. That's my experience. They want to talk about the problems of being a woman. And if you want to move the conversation over to the men, this is tough. It's not easy. It's like it doesn't exist. There are no problems of being a man, it seems. It's quite amusing. You should try it if you haven't already. Yeah, this is a survey. It's done by Sky News uh, with the British people. 67% uh, of the British people believe that feminism has gone too far. Interesting. Uh, that's a lot of people. And I think this is a tough question to answer. Yes, you have to sort of go up against the flow, don't you? Yes. So that's what they did, 67%. And there's another one, 15% of the women that was asked say that they would be less likely to date a man who calls himself a feminist. That's a pretty tough question too, isn't it? Yeah, you have to say this. Yeah, I wouldn't date a guy if he says he's a feminist. I think there's a lot more women who would agree with this privately. And in the men, it's even more. 20% of the men say that they would be less likely to sort a relationship with a feminist woman. Yes. Okay. Here's another one. 25% uh, of the men say that they have changed their behavior to avoid being called a sexist. Yeah, I bet. I tried to change my behavior. It didn't work. Well, maybe I, maybe a little. Okay. And there's 70% has accepted the feminist claim that men earn more than women without taking into account the broad spectrum of causes behind this, such as different choices of professions, etc. Yeah, I think this number is also very, very high in Sweden. This is a truth in Sweden. Men earn more than women. Yes. Well, there's a difference in choices of profession. Absolutely. See? All right, that's all for today. So I wish you a great weekend. Yeah, bye.